God instructed Noah to house pairs of every animal on the planet within seven days of finishing the ark's construction. God told him to gather animals in groups of two or seven, depending on the species. He and his family were to board the ark at the conclusion of the seven days to flee the fury of the floods. When the days that the Lord had appointed were through, Noah and his family joined the animals in the ark. God sent the floodwaters down during a 40-day and 40-night period when Noah was 600 years old. The seas kept rising until no more of the land could be seen. With the exception of Noah and his family, whom God protected, every man and animal that were left perished in the flood which went on for 150 days. What's the main point? After the ark was finished, Noah and his family boarded it along with the pairs of animals. The message of this chapter is how patient Noah was to finish the ark and to receive God's next instructions. Then, the world was subjected to the dreadful destruction of God's deluge. What can we learn from this chapter? The best lesson we can get from this chapter is to be prepared for the coming of God. Nobody knows when the second coming of God will happen. Even Jesus said that in Mark 13 verses 32 to 33, but about that day or hour no one knows, not even the angels in heaven, nor the Son, but only the Father. Be on guard. Be alert. You do not know when that time will come. Additionally, like Noah, we should take good care of our health. God gave him the job of building the ark despite the fact that he was already old at the time of the great flood. He had incredible physical strength because he could construct such a large ark. His submission to God's will was clearly demonstrated in this chapter as well. Let us pray. Almighty God, I pray for the grace I need to follow your commands. Do not allow me to turn deaf and blind on things I see and hear from you. Give me strength to remain faithful to you each day. Amen. Thanks for joining us today. For daily inspiration on God's Word, please like and follow our Facebook page and YouTube channel. The links are in the description. Please also visit www.wisdombegun.com genesis for more thought-provoking discussions on the book of Genesis plus free downloads and presentations about the Genesis story, ideal for use at Bible study groups or Sunday school lessons. Please support our channel by liking this video and subscribing. Thanks. Wisdom Begun. God's words delivered daily.